What's going on guys? It's Alec, AKA Python Don, back for another video. And today I wanna to show you guys how one $5 item completely changes the way your BMW drives. Let's go. Okay, so first thing you wanna to do, get yourself in a Home Depot. I don't know what aisle I'm in. I think I'm in, find the aisle with the fasteners, okay? And you're gonna look for Stainless steel hex bolts, three eighth inch by one and one half inches long. Get yourself one of these. Okay, then in that same aisle, you're gonna look for these. Heavy duty felt pads, one inch wide, three bucks. Plus the bolt, talking about under $5. All right guys, correction. This is the bolt you're gonna need. This is one and a half inch long by three eighths. That other one I grabbed was actually a half inch by one inch. Okay, now you're gonna take your bolt. You can see like mine, you're gonna apply your sticky uh, bumper protector on top. It's gonna come out a little bit because it's an inch wide. Then you get some scissors and literally just cut around the shape to get it roughly like this. Okay. Now you're gonna get down under your clutch pedal. You're gonna see a hole here. You can, even, you can even see where the marking was where the cap is. There's a cap screwed in, just unscrew it. Take your bolt, screw that baby in. So this is as if you were at a red light, light goes green, I'm coming off looking for it looking for it the bites right about there 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 accelerating and then i'm off so that whole process is just so much longer and it's just like a guessing game you're playing and that's kind of what i talked about in the acura video if you guys remember one of the major takeaways was just the shifting in the acura how direct it was because of the clutch take was so much quicker so let me show you with the clutch stop on okay clutch stop in right there and your bite's right there so you can even use your ankle to come off push in just so much more convenient when I installed this it had to have been within two weeks after owning the car because I just could not get over it from driving the Acura and how, how the Acura you literally you can have your foot on the floor and just barely come off the clutch and the car's already moving and you just know exactly where that point is at. So by having that, that clutch stop installed, it really changes um, your activation point of uh, you know takeoff. So um, really when, when drivers and they're watching video reviews on cars and publishers and everything are talking about connecting with the car and really having confidence in the car because you're connecting with it. What I think to me, what that means is understanding all the car's kind of trigger points for the car to literally move an inch. You need, you need a driver engagement. Um, so that was my issue. And I, in that video review or the five things the Acura does better than the BMW was that it was really vague in the BMW. You would think a driver's car is really not giving you um a clear trigger point or um one of those multiple buttons that you need to work the car so the more you can understand all of the car's buttons uh the more you can control it and the more in tune you feel with the car so the clutch point or the clutch stop gives you that clear sp uh, location it kind of marks um, where your bite point is because you know the moment you're off of the pedal the car is going to move so it's kind of marking that spot for you. So you got one of the five, six buttons you need to really work a car done. The other one could be the way it steers and handles, the rear wheel drive and knowing when it's gonna kick out could be another button. Um, all those little things that if you can master and the better that the car communicates those things to you, the more confident in the car you're gonna feel and the better you're gonna be at driving it and more in tune with where those buttons uh, limits are and um, yeah, so I feel like the clutch stop is like one of the best things you could do to the BMW to really change right off the bat for very cheap how the car drives. Like it's one of the best things you can do for the money, hands down. 
and for as cheap as it, as it is, guys, everybody should be putting down this video and going and doing it if you don't have one installed already. Big things coming on this, guys. Thank you for watching. I hope I didn't ramble too much at the end, but I do like, again, getting into like the theories and philosophies of like the car itself for those who are really into driving and stuff like I am. Um, yeah, more things to come, guys. Please like and subscribe if you guys can. We're trying to get to 200 subscribers. Um, I think we can do it. Uh, thank you guys for everything. Leave a comment if you guys have any questions and I'd, I'd feel to help uh, uh, chat with you guys and just uh, yeah, get to know me more if you guys like. Um, I'll see you on the next video. Peace.